Hey guys, it's me again, your fantasy girl, Jennifer. You can call me Jenny also if you want. I won't mind. I was just dreaming about this big match of football player playing ball with me and spending the whole afternoon with me eating chocolate. Then playing ball, then soaking in a bathtub of chocolate with a football in the bathtub. <sighs> anyway. In the middle of this sporty, chocolatey fantasy I was having, I was just thinking about my Indian friends. That they're having such different kind of fantasies. They keep thinking of a ball game of a different kind. You know, my boss wants me to come up with a new and brilliant concept every day. Every day, yeah? You know what he says? He says, Jigni is dude. He says dude a lot. You need to keep your eye on the ball. In today's competitive world, you can't afford to take your eye off the ball for even a second, dude. Even a second. You know, I want to tell him, do you think when Sachin is on the pitch, he scores a century every time? I mean, he's been out on zero so many times and he's still the country's hero. I mean, what can you do? Sometimes the ball rises higher than expected. Sometimes it keeps low. And then the pitch is there. What if it's rough? The ball will naturally skid. Yaar, teri ko cricket ka itna gyan hai, then go and play it. Log on into www.indianfantasyleague.com because fantasy is better than a sling. If you like this insight that I got for you on the fantasies of Indian cricket lovers, well, you have to let me know. Research have shown me that fantasizing makes your mind stronger and of course it's better on the asleep thing. Buena lindos, I would love to know how you mix your fantasies with cricket. You could just send me your clip to fantasycricket at gmail.com. Till then, happy fantasizing!